Sarah from PinkCricket.com and today I want to show you how to import digital papers into your Silhouette Studio so that you can use them to fill in and color different things that you might want to print and cut. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead to File, Import to my library, and then we're going to find a paper pack that's on our computer somewhere or whatever it is and it doesn't have to be a paper pack you can also find a pattern somewhere online that you like for instance if you wanted to use um, a certain mascot or something and use its background you can use that as something to fill in too so I'm going to go ahead here's my paper pack I'm going to choose one of the papers and I'm just going to click OK and then I need to put in keywords so I'm going to put in pink because it's pink, stripes, because there are stripes, and then I'm going to put peep squeaker because that's the collection, and then I'm also going to put lettering delight because that is where it's from. Okay, then you can also use a description. You can also put the artist here. So however you want to do it, however much information you want to fill out. I'm usually not too detailed. I usually just throw in a few keywords, and I click OK. Then I'm going to show you exactly where that goes. It goes to my own designs and I'm going to go ahead and I'm just going to drag it to the folder that I want it to go in. So I'm going to drag it to my patterns. Okay. And then let me show you what this allows you to do. So we're going to find that paper here in just a second. We can type whatever we want. We can open a shape or however we're going to do it. And then if we're going to fill it in with the, the paper that we just downloaded, we're going to highlight this. And then we're going to go to Fill Pattern. And then it will be all the way at the bottom. See? There's my pink stripes. Isn't that awesome? So you can use all your digital papers. Use, a, use them for print and cut right inside your Silhouette Studio. Thanks for watching, everyone. Have a great day.